You know what? Last night I went to bed early and I was really excited about getting out of my bike. I set my alarm and I was ready for it. But when I woke up this morning, I just, I'm just not feeling it anymore. Yeah, a lot of people have that. You know when you end up falling out of love with one thing that you love doing? Yeah, that's kind of exactly how I feel. There must be a way to fall back in love with cycling. I think you're right. First of all, we need to find out why we've fallen out of love with cycling. Mm. Maybe you've worked really hard over the last few months and you've pushed it on the bike and you've stagnated and you've lost the love of it because, well, that's just frustrating, isn't it? Yeah, or you've moved to a new place and you've got rubbish roads and you haven't got anyone to ride with, or you've been sick for a while. There can be many things. Yeah, or is it just the fear of crashing, especially if you're racing? I mean, no one wants to crash. No, exactly. The first thing you need to do is highlight what it is that you've stopped loving about riding your bike. You know what, mate? I just can't do 350 watts for half an hour today. Dude, stop taking it so seriously. Actually, that's a really good point. Cycling doesn't have to be all about average power numbers. Lap this, interval that, TSS here. It can just be good fun. So you could just head out the door, ride as fast or as far as you feel like. And hey, why not even stop? Yeah, and group rides can be so much fun also. Get out with your mates, have a joke and just enjoy it. After all, cycling is good fun. Yeah, and if you feel like racing them up the climb, do why it. not do that as well? Race you up. <laughs> I can't get in. Ah! I've often found it difficult to stay motivated when riding by myself. I know there are lots of people who love riding by themselves. That feeling of solitude can really help for some to clear your mind after a difficult week at work. But for most people, finding the motivation to go for a long or hard ride by themselves is difficult. If you've just moved and you don't know anybody where you live, then it's pretty hard not to end up riding by yourself. So if you are finding it hard work riding by yourself, then that sounds like the perfect opportunity to find a cycling club. Almost every city will have a number of different cycling clubs these days, and if you can't decide on which one to join, then why not try them all? Most cycling clubs will be very happy to have new people come and join, but it's often a good idea to drop someone in the club a message before you do. That way you'll know when they meet and what their rides are like. So stick with cycling. It's a great way to meet friends, go out on group rides and enjoy the outdoors. Soon you'll love it again. Why don't you try new things? In cycling, there are loads of disciplines to get your teeth stuck into. Yeah, cyclocross, track racing. Hey, there's even that weird thing that people do called gravel riding. Or mountain biking or fixed gear racing. Loads of stuff for you to try out and keep it nice and fresh. Yeah, the whole idea is to mix it up a little bit, really, because if you spend your entire time doing one discipline, it can get a little bit stale. And it's also a really good thing to do to practise new skills on different terrains and surfaces. Agreed. What are you getting your teeth stuck into then, mate? I'm going to go and join GMBN, I think. I'm going to do a bit of cyclocross. Ooh. Or running. Should we do a bit of running? Can't run for your problems. You know what? I'm going to take back my comment about gravel riding because this is amazing. Look at the view and there's not a car in sight. That makes it more fun for me. Yeah, keep it fresh. Try all the disciplines. After all, cycling's all about enjoyment. So go out and enjoy it. Yep. How about we go and get some cake though? Yeah, I might go mountain biking after lunch. Ooh, yeah, I quite like that idea. Let's go and do something here. So Chris, do you feel a bit better about cycling? Have you fallen back in love with it? You know what? I kind of enjoyed looking at my cycling in a different way and kind of seeing it as something I could do with my mates for a bit of a laugh and not just, you know, power numbers and results. Yeah. So if you've fallen back into love with cycling, then let us know in the comments below. And if you want to see more videos on mounted bike, cyclocross or fixed wheel, then click down here.